Guys, it's Geography Lover here. Welcome back to another brand new video. And today we're doing another 2020 prediction. Now, as of July 25th, 2020. So there have been some changes in the polling data um, from the last one I made back in June and the one back in May. So I want to do a July, um, because I did one at the beginning of the month, now I'm doing one at the end of the month. So let's just give Trump and Biden the safe states that we know. The votes for Trump and the 183 for Biden so far. Totally like that. I'm most likely going to be safe electoral votes. But, um, Alright, here we are. Sorry. Alright, so I, oh, sorry. Alright, so I gave Biden 183 and Trump 126. And let's add the, um, kind of, safe, uh, states. You say in lean, 204. Um, this gives. Also mean. This gives Trump 205 and Biden 232, which Clinton got back in 2016. Um, we have some more kind of changing data with uh, Pennsylvania, oh, is that, Pennsylvania and Michigan leaning blue now. They are going back to what they were back in 2012 when they went blue. Wisconsin, the data hasn't totally come in yet. I mean, on other websites like 271.com, it has said they are voting for Biden this year. Um, and also Arizona has put back to the Republicans, but very by what by 1%. It is so low that it's not even uh, comparable. And Florida is still voting. And North Carolina is now up for grabs. But people are saying that officially Wisconsin is back to being blue. Now, the only state that hasn't really gotten data is North Carolina. Currently, they are voting red, but it's not uh, totally sure yet. As of now, I'm putting it still red, but who knows by the election it can turn blue. Same with Florida. Arizona, the, the polling data has switched back to Trump's favor rather than Biden's favor back when it did back in you know May and June. But the polling data has been... Um, yeah, red for a little bit now, for about a month. So that's why I put it back as red, but it could switch back to blue. It is still July, people. It is not November yet, unless you're watching this after the election and you, you know what you know the results. But, um, yeah, that's all. I don't think Montana, Utah, and Alaska are going like with Texas. I put Texas and not Missouri either um, for now, but that doesn't mean they will. I'm just saying, in general, most people don't do that right now, but due to COVID-19, they might be less lenient. Same with Florida, Arizona, and North Carolina. They could vote for Biden for, you know, due to COVID-19 restrictions. That's why people, I mean, rising cases in Florida, Texas, it's very bad there, so uh, I don't think they're really going to like that. All right, thank you guys for watching this video. Please like and subscribe, and if you want to watch another video, watch right here, and if you want to subscribe,